Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Bachelor. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day, before starting the video, please subscribe and keep watching for more details videos. When does Rachel Nance go home on The Bachelor? Fans are dying to know when Rachel Nance is going to get sent home. There are only three women left, Daisy Kent, Kelsey Anderson, and Rachel Nance. Out of the three women left, viewers do not believe Rachel is the one for Joey. She is the only one who did not discuss love with Joey, and people feel like that speaks volumes for their connection. However, could fans be wrong? Keep reading to find out when she gets sent home. Joey Grazia Day struggles with journey. Joey Grazia Day has struggled this season with feeling confident in his relationships. It seems as though his time with Charity Lawson made him weary of the other women's feelings for him. He was ready to propose to Charity when she chose someone else. This has stayed with him throughout his journey, and he has expressed how he feels it will happen again even though he does not want to think that way. Kelsey Anderson recently made this fear return when she left Joey a note saying they needed to talk. When does Rachel Nance get sent home? It seems as though Rachel Nance is going to be the next one to go. She was kept after the hometown dates, and fans wished Maria Jorgas was the one to stay. However, fans do feel as though Rachel has the least strong connection with Joey out of the three, so it only makes sense for her to go next. Charity Lawson also recently stood up for Rachel as fans were hating on her for staying over Maria. The comments to Rachel after hometowns are extremely weird. 1. It's a show relax too. You don't have to tear someone else down to support the person you are rooting for. It's giving mean girl energy, the same energy y'all was wilding about earlier this season. She is not wrong. People hated some of the girls strongly for being mean girls, but they are now doing the same to Rachel, and it got hypocritical. It seems as though Rachel is the next to go and the final two will be Kelsey and Daisy. Joey just has stronger connections with the other two women. They have all expressed falling in love, but Rachel. This process has been hard for Joey and the women. However, Joey fears rejection and is scared the woman he picks in the end will end up not feeling the same. Do you like Rachel? Who do you hope Joey chooses? Sound off in the comments below. Do Bachelor producers warn before entering Fantasy Suite. Dovinal Ubico recently revealed to fans if the producers of The Bachelor producers give them a warning before entering the Fantasy Suite. All Ubico was on Charity Lawson season. It was Dovinal Ubico and Joey Grazia Day in the final two when Charity ultimately chose Doton. This broke Joey's heart, but he ended up becoming the lead role in finding his future wife. However, with it getting to the fantasy suites, fans want to know if the producers just barge in. Dotanal Ubico and Charity Lawson Charity was the bachelorette and gave viewers an enjoyable season. On the show, fans fell in love with Joey Grazia Day. This led Joey to become the current bachelor. This has been the most watched season yet and fans are here for it. He has had a fear of rejection ever since Charity chose Doton over him. This crushed him, but assured him that he was ready to find love of his own. Charity thinks Joey is one of the best leading roles the show has ever had. This had to have been a compliment to Joey as fans feel the same way. Joey is left with three wonderful women, Daisy Kent, Rachel Nance, and Kelsey Anderson. Fans are dying to know who Joey will end up choosing and what Kelsey's note was about. Do the producers give any warning? Fans asked Charity and Doton if the producers give any warning before they come into the fantasy suite in the morning. During fantasy suites, do they give you a warning before coming in the morning to film? Doton gave his answer. Hell no, they just pull up on your ass, they do not. Charity also replied to Doton's comment. Luckily, it's in the morning, so they're not walking in on a show. This seems to be a total invasion of privacy from producers. However, it could be an attempt to keep the show genuine. It seems as though in the morning, the stars should make sure they're decent before the producers come in. It shocked fans to hear that they do not give a warning at all before coming in. However, maybe they do it that way to make it as genuine as possible. 
Although, the fantasy suite is supposed to give the couple the privacy they have not been able to have the whole season. What do you think about this? Sound off in the comments below.